A lot of people try to use my under eye bags as a way to discredit the carnivore diet and you know depending on the lighting whether I've gotten some sun recently how much sleep I've gotten you know there's various degrees about how bad they can look but I've had under eye bags since I was a baby you know the doctors told my parents it was allergies but you know literally from when I was born I've had severe bags under my eyes and I was fed a soy formula I probably didn't develop as optimally as I could have so as much as I would like to attribute all of these things to improper nutrition and modern baby formula things like that it's not really solving the problem I mean I also have pictures of when I was young and my eye bags look far worse than they do now and one big reason I think my YouTube channel has become drastically more successful is because I started tanning and improved my appearance to look much much healthier you know in 2016 2017 I was very very pale uh, the contrast between my pale skin and my eye bags was much more drastic and they looked a lot worse I mean people would say that I wouldn't look healthy because of the complexion of my eyes but now uh, in my videos with decent lighting if I've gotten tan once or twice a week I look perfectly fine so compared to what I used to look like when I was a kid uh, I pretty much alleviated the appearance problems of these under eye bags the main issue that I can attribute to making them look worse is definitely sleep uh, if I don't get enough sleep you know a good eight hours then you know I'm gonna feel it and I know my eyes aren't gonna look as bright and vibrant as they should uh, another big factor which might be much more of a factor in appearance as opposed to how I feel than the first is sun exposure and if I tan if I get some you know whether it's a tanning bed once or twice a week or get some sun on my face a couple times a week that greatly improves the appearance of my under eye bags uh, in addition to that removing inflammation from the diet staying very well hydrated uh, trying to reduce stress levels all of those things have contributed to me kind of fixing my under eye bags and if one of these things is out of whack they'd look terrible without a doubt you know if I don't sleep one night they're gonna look really bad unless the lighting's good if I don't get enough sun for a couple weeks they're gonna look bad unless my sleep is pretty much perfect so unfortunately you know there's no real solution to under eye bags in the case of someone like me who's had them their entire lives of course as very evident by you know how I can literally have raccoon eyes one day and then go from perfectly healthy looking skin another day you know there's ways to improve it drastically that you can achieve through diet sun health exercise as well uh, just overall living a very healthy lifestyle getting enough sleep sun and all of these things will contribute to you know removing under eye bags you know there are people who are fortunate that can you know never sleep and they don't have any eye bags and then there are people who get plenty of sleep and have terrible under eye bags but it's safe to say that if you fix elements in your diet from nutrient density to removing inflammatory foods if you get a decent amount of sun exposure whether it's tanning or from the sun if you hydrate properly and you get enough sleep you will improve your appearance to the point where your eye bag shouldn't be a point of discussion for anyone I mean that's my experience like I have no problem about people being honest and using things as ammunition against other people but it just doesn't make sense in this context you know it's something I've had my whole life I don't I feel like I shouldn't have to explain this to people every time it comes up uh, it, it seems completely ridiculous and I've had a lot of people comment oh Italian people have those features all the time people have dark circles under their eyes so you know apparently it's a feature that is a lot more common in I mean Italians like me but uh, what are you gonna do so thank you guys for watching uh, if you guys would like to support me please subscribe and share the video if you guys want to check out my patreon I will be doing exclusive videos for patreon now uh, maybe sign up and let me know what videos you guys would like to see uh, if you guys would like to check out my Amazon shop I don't really get a lot but if you guys are gonna buy stuff might as well be products that I use in my day-to-day -day life as well I'm on Instagram I'm on Twitter uh, please drop a follow guys send me a message 
And last but not least, if you guys would like to reach out to me for one-on-one -on -one consultations in regards to optimizing your overall health, feel free to send me an email, frankatofano at gmail.com, or reach out to me through the contact form on my website below.